we're back. I like how one tip was keep an eye on your blood charts. They have add up correctly. And Kadawa offers great rewards. A, I'm in campaign. I can't access my blood charts. And B, she doesn't offer that great rewards. She's basically, hey, you want to go gamble after you get something? I mean, you still usually always get rail, though, so that was that. But getting a legendary or set item, it doesn't exactly that easy. Anyway, you guys have often talked to, I think. Oh, I gotta go check again, though. I did a bit with the story. Oh, the burp's back. It's just there to distract me. It's just there to distract me. Make me think there was a tree veil, but there's not a tree veil. They just say they're there, but they're not there. But I gotta go poke them anyway. Just because. Never know, it could actually be there. Oh, does that remind me? Oh, I have to add tree. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is how it ends? I have some new items that I'm so... Did you hear? Old Rumford has us down here. Hey, come over here. I've got some new things you really need to do. There was like entirely two main merchants. That's the only three you can make a dog here. It's like one. I mean, why are they that many merchants? No, I think that's a story at some point. By the way, find the cemetery the first place. By the way, this here is where you would go to The truth bans you. I will enjoy this. My curse upon you. Your evil undoes you. The truth burns you. Some riff you enter a anywhere. perfect strike. Combined gems. It's combined 
I'm trying to defense as well. You die! This apprentice's spirit dwells within the unborn body. Hated one should be told. Spirit aid me. Perfect strike! The bones beneath this tomb scream of madness and betrayal. The crown is near. I guess that that was supposed to come out and attack me. And I was just like, oh god, I got to go. I have to dress. My hand have to dress. I will enjoy this! On you. So by the way, the crash is dead. No, I will not allow you to bring that monster Leoric back to this world. Pretty much in every 
Okay, Uno. They have this. Just like a rimstone that basically you back outside. Because why would we, why would we make... It's convenient. It's something that, well, the other two had at least a way. But they realize that people aren't exactly... Well, they don't like walking all the way back to places they've already been. Places like Quill that don't have any point. That slows it down. Surprised because they added these to just teleport you back out. But anyway, they say to use the town for You don't need it. I don't think I ever used the town for It's gonna be like, hey, you didn't use the town for because let's face it, we don't really need to go back in. We just need to go back here and be like, hey. You found the crown. I did. Truth be told, I didn't think you'd make it back alive. Ah, it needs repair. Should be no problem. By the way. It's good to work again. Pat. Pat. There. New as the day it was placed upon the Black King's head. I need something more than making spades to occupy my mind. I want my life to mean something. We all seek meaning in grief. Maybe we will find it together. I have other news. Your apprentice died his final death. I am sorry. Fool boy. Hope for the worst and you will not be disappointed. Thank you for the news. And hey, you gave us crappy gloves. By the way, I can talk to you. Yay. I see the villagers weeping for their dead. You do not. How is it that you alone know of the unformed land? I don't know what you're talking about. You did me a <laughs> service and I'm grateful, but I don't care to speak of my wife. Ah, you bury your tears. Hear me when I tell you that I understand. Long ago before I became a warrior, my little sister died of a terrible illness. I did not sleep for long days. I did not eat. The spirits, they whispered and sang to me until my tears dried. They sing to me still, and I smile to hear my sister among them. With all due respect, I don't want to hear about your beliefs or your spirits. If you don't have any business for me, just leave me be. Ah, it's fine being a witch doctor. It's like, what the hell are you talking about? Spirits and shit? Oh, yeah, yeah, man. From the east shall come a monarch whose rule begins in blood and ends in bone. In the life of a comet will he die a third and final death at the hands of true men. I think that he's talking about, uh, Stout. Also for F sight, Stain. Just, just turn back on, you stupid. You stupid thing. <laughs> Like, oh no, Steam can connect. Mm. Like, just just turn back on. Stop being. <laughs> oh, you go check King's house. Got to hear the bird. Yeah, the bird. I try. wish that Leia could live a different life, a more normal life. But alas, such is not her fate. When I pass, there is none but her to continue my work, and the future of this world hangs in the balance. That's a lot of pressure for our self game. Alright, go check her out. Or room, I should say. No, she's at that room. Go back outside. The crown is in my keeping. Direct me now to the lost king. Ah, at last. With it, you can unlock the sealed door in the room where you rescued me and enter the royal crypts. When you find the skeleton king, place the crown atop his head and destroy him. The skeleton king's sickness infects this land. I will put an end to it and find the star. I volunteer to help because it seemed the right thing to do, but I'm no leader of men. The spirits speak to all of us. Listen, 
and find guidance. That's a simple thing for you to say. You were born to fight monsters like the Risen Dead. Me? Well, I'm yeah, just a yeah, farmer. The news continues to worsen. How can you continue to wade into the fray with nary a thought for your own safety? It is madness. No, we are not mad. We fight for your people. The final death waits for all of us if we fail. This is sanity. Huh, I guess well, you're a farmer and yet you fight through thousands of monsters. Oh yeah, you mean Dungeon Siege? Dungeon Siege was fun. Go back and do it again at some point. Farm though is it good for the graphics of course. A bit dated. And it's a, it also suffers from the whole, it's basically one of those Diablo clones, well, yeah. It's not as convenient as this. And you really should. It's like why I, I struggle with Sacred 2 at times, because... Sacred 2's at least got the convenience of waypoint, fast travel, or some stuff like that. And res, res and cells, and all that. But it also suffers from the slow aspect. You seem to think that my life is full of ease. If the Apple one I can tolerate, it's hard because work. you don't really Price have to go back. gems don't just leap into my pockets, you know. You will stop you stealing the after a point, then. And the cathedral. And the levels of the cathedral. You don't have to go all the way across the entire map. Have to go down. Go back up. Go back down. Go back up. By the way, now for some reason. Spirit aid me. I will enjoy this. Maintain your incantations. You will suffer oh, magic. Your magic. I am free. Now, back to my mission. 
Who are you? You will know soon enough. Help me find my gear. I will reward you well. Tell me, what brought you to this infernal place? I go to face the Skeleton King. As do I. The cultists dragged me past this glowing pit. What made it? I wish to know this as well. Down this way! There are my weapons! Oh, he's no longer following. He's free! Do not let him be off! I am Cormac, warrior of the Templar Order. If it is the Skeleton King you seek, then you will have to fight your way past John Dar. There is no reason we should hunt alone. No, there is not. So by the way, just an introduction to you how the borrower works. Do you know how to borrow? Can we talk to him? I am Cormac. Warrior of the Templar Order. If it is the Skeleton King you seek, then you will have to fight your way past John Dar. There is no reason you should hunt alone. No, there is not. So we got Cormac. He's the Templar. Black magic bars our way. But the will of a Templar is stronger. Hey, look. You were a Templar, John Dar. How could you succumb to this coven? The coven, please forgive me. My vision was clouded by the coven's evil magic. Betrayal can never be forgiven. Thank you for your aid. I will go with you on your hunt for the Skeleton King. But there is one condition. If we find the sacred tomes of my order, they are mine. Agreed. Then onwards we go to fight the Skeleton Why King. Why are the sacred tomes of your order hidden inside the people? Up and now he's just standing his The truth burns you! I strike at your heart. Uh, 
concentration is going to be to Keep your distance from him. This burden is mine to bear. May death bring peace from your madness, Leoric. Traitors! Even in death, the armies of Condorus will still obey their king. Even if you will not. So yeah, locked on. Uh, locked on and... So the weird thing was... So... The skeleton team was on... Like, level... Three? Of the... Cathedral? The Diablo 1? Well, technically he had his own paper. Really. But still, he was in level 3. Yeah. Thomas Lockdown was all the way down to like level 14, 15. Somewhere down there. Like, how the hell Lockdown kills and then wanders down further and further and came like a dude knife? Well, You dare to bring the warmth of life into my tomb? Defeat me!
cannot carry more. Technically better than what we're wearing. Technically by it increase our damage by a lot. It also increases the effect of any gym stock again designed by Samsung. Increase our cooldown by decent bit. The only problem though is I don't know why it has that level of damage, that does not seem right. That really doesn't seem right, but okay. That doesn't make sense. <laughs> uh, Arcane Snap, Arcane Smaller, Up again. Hey, look, there's the Undead Crown. I mean, look at the Undead Crown. Compared to the Arch Crown. Yeah, they don't look the same now, do they? Ah, here is the crater. So you are the fire that fell from the sky. Why do I find you here at the source of this place's darkness? I am. I... I was. I... I remember falling. Do you remember why you are here? I am not your enemy. I think. Yes, I... I believe I have come with a warning. 
The darkness. The darkness is coming. I must. I don't remember. I will take you to Cain. He will lead us to understanding. The mystery is yet to be solved. I now learn that the fallen star is a man. He remembers little of himself. I will bring him to Deckard Cain. Perhaps then he will have some answers. That crazy old Uncle Deckard should have answers. Not at all. They just have the most important parts. By the way, I think your companions do get uh, progression even if they're not actually equipped. Whoever he is. I don't can't equip this. I think they actually do get progression over time, which is why he looks different than how he did in the. You know. Down in the cup. Anyway. This man was the falling star. No man could survive such a thing. Who are you? What are you? A warrior, I think. I came bearing grave news, but I cannot remember. Your message might be all that can save us from impending doom. Tell me everything you remember, stranger. Every detail. Falling. Fire. A sword of great power. It was part of me. But it shattered into three pieces as I fell. It is vital that we find those pieces. I believe the sword made whole will restore your memory. The Goatmen are rampaging through the fields. Could the sword have anything to do with that? Of course, of course! Just as the dead rose around the stranger, the sword pieces drove the Goatmen to madness. I will bring back the sword and bring peace to the Khazra, one way or another. What else do you remember? Only that there were surges of light and a kind of pain. How do you feel now? The emptiness gnaws at me. It is a constant frustration. Do not punish yourself. We will seek answers together. Yeah, but how are you stay here in town while I do it? The Herodrim were powerful mages gathered together by the Archangel Tyriel to defeat the three prime evils, Diablo, Mephisto, and Baal. They devoted themselves fully to the destruction of the Demon Lords and left behind valuable tomes and teachings. How did you become the last of the Herodrim? My ancestor was the leader of the Herodrim, Jared Kane. When the Herodrim died out, their tomes stayed in my family. I was thrilled by tales of the Herodrim as a little boy, but it wasn't until I returned to them as an adult that I realized they contained deeper truths. So basically everyone else died, that's why he's the last. You have nothing else to say? Oh, Tyriel is the angel of justice. He has been helping mankind for generations, though he is forbidden to do so in any direct manner. Long ago, the high heavens and the burning hells made a pact as a result of the Sin War that they would not interfere yeah, in our world. This deal has been broken by the demons. Can Tyriel not act? 
the Angiris Council, the archangels that lead heaven, almost destroyed our world once to keep the demons from spreading their corruption upon it. If Tyriel were to act directly, it would alert the Council to the demons' activities here and imperil us all. Uh, I'm pretty sure they should know that we're all I can hardly believe it, but the falling star is a man. When Uncle Deckard realized this, he was crushed. I know he was hoping for something more miraculous. I have some new items that I'm so Oh wait, you you have something new. Wait, you, you black black Do not question the path you are on. It will lead you through things that will try your very soul. But you'll always have me to talk to. And where would I be without your guidance? You pretend you are a rock. But I know the softness you don't want anyone to see. Why else would you continue to come and talk to Miriam? Because you have a little motto at the top of your head that says I should talk to Did you to see you. that stranger next to old King? The attacks may be slowing How about down. You, Shen? But this town is Shen. Oh. Uh, perhaps it was a jewel uh, that fell from the sky. Oh, uh, 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 did you ever consider that? It was not a jewel. It was a stranger. A man. A man? Now that is strange. Uh, where do you suppose he came from? And how did he survive his fall? Uh, 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 did he have any jewels on him? Yeah, he had Jim Slowfall. Don't tell anyone, but I've got some new items. And hey... The way is open. So we go out here. Wait, no, this is not the right way. Yes, it is. Three. Oh, the, right, the one by the silver road, because they can't go to the fat road, though. The silver is still clear, because we haven't reached the map yet. Go. Because the map reset every time you basically enter the game and enter the entrance game. You know, for bounties, you just basically on uh, Restart. Wait, let me go back to the main menu. Go back. Oh, I found that though, sometimes my game's been having this weird issue where it gets too laggy. Since it gets too laggy, it basically doesn't actually let me go through some loading screen. So you can go back to the main well, it says I lost my connection, even though sometimes I end up like, the fire you load, so I'm like, hey, you don't have your connection anymore. Yeah, you clearly do. And then I have to go back through the whole thing. And I bet that, even though I was like, I strike at your heart! must die. I see magic I have seen before coming from this cave. What I seek must be inside. You are evil and does you. Oh god, you can't have it. Yeah, you can't have it. Then.
kill him. Oh, hi. We must hurry with the ritual. Manga. A stranger's light surrounds this sword piece. Who are you to take what is mine? I will return this sword to its owner. Regardless, I have claimed it. I am Magda, and I lead this coven. The shard is mine. To hell with you, witch! Very well. Let the games begin. Well fought, but you will never possess the next piece. It has fallen where only the ancients may tread. The sword was in the possession of Dark Ones, under the will of a woman named Magda. Uncle Deckard, you sound like those dark cultists you told me about. Very good, Leah. You have been paying attention. Stranger, does any of this jar your memory? I have no memory of this coven, but I sense a far darker shadow guiding its hand. Magda's coven is a remnant of an ancient religion called the Triune that worshipped the prime evils as gods. There will always be those who will follow evil. Who do they now worship? The last two evils, Asmodan and Belial, remain. And if either of them are behind this coven, then our troubles are only beginning. Okay. This fragment holds an ancient and fearsome power. Indeed, it feels familiar to me, though the rest is still unclear. This is the weapon of a master warrior. If that is what I am, then my strength has gone with my memory. Patience. Time may return one or both to you. Magda's words betrayed her. The next piece of the sword rests where only ancients may tread. That makes me think of the drowned temple near the festering woods. I remember you telling me about it, Uncle. Exactly, Leah. The temple was home to the Nephilim. Leah, your knowledge could be invaluable. You must go and help our friend retrieve the sword piece. The Nephilim were ancient humans with fantastic powers. Legend holds that they waged a terrible battle near the temple and that their ghosts still war with one another. Oh, I go check Doesn't feel right being in Uncle Deckard's room when he's not here. But he is there. He, he's right outside. Like, he's right there. I'm just, you know, checking all your stuff. Do you have a new journal entry? I've decided to write an epic poem. This is my room. Do you like it? Burk. What? You're not really thinking of reading my journal, are you? Yes, I am. Uncle Deckard believes the key to unlocking the stranger's memory is reassembling his sword. I wish I could say this was another of Uncle's crazy theories, but I can't deny that these ominous events are starting to really scare me. Well, you finally actually start to see the whole map of the series. How the ship comes. Living in Tristram. 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 This should happen to all the time. That's that surprising. Is that why it's fine? You and I aren't so different. I have great power within me, too. The only difference is, I have no control over mine. That sounds troubling. It's only happened a few times in my life, and only when I was in grave danger. Something rises up from deep within me and, well, I can't really explain it. 
We finished them off. I'm not quite sure what all the fuss is about. Few farmers turn up dead, and everyone goes running for the hills. I've lived off these lands for 20 years, and I have not seen any bloodthirsty monsters running about. No reason I should leave a perfectly good harvest. I'm sorry, do you can miss the whole thing? The king murdered him half the town. After much searching, I have found a promising lead. A family near New Tristram has obtained a valuable relic, and poor fools that they are, they haven't the slightest idea what to do with it. I have some idea of what to do with their daughter, though. <laughs> and through her, I'll get my prize. A perfect strike! These fields used to be so beautiful. You there! Please help! They're going to kill my friend! Thieves are going to kill my friend if we don't do something. Help me break these bonds and see for yourself. What do they want with your friend? She's just a farmer's daughter, Sasha, but she has a relic that the thieves are after. Where is the relic? I'll never tell you. Release the girl. The relic belongs to her. You actually believe what this scoundrel tells you? Fine, you fools. We'll kill the both of you. You won't get away from us this time! <laughs> this isn't over. The rest of the Thieves' Guild will find you. Here's the relic, my love. I hid it like you asked. Father's grown suspicious of us, but that won't matter once we're married. It won't be long, right? Of course, my dear. Soon we will settle down to a quiet life of tilling the fields and raising brats, uh, children. But first, I have to sell this relic. Alas, I must travel away with my friend here to do so. You wish to come with me? Yes, yes! You look like you know a lot about markets. Now, lead the way! Okay. Wait! The relic is a fake! Gods, I should have known! You seem like you could use a helping hand, and I sure as hell don't want to stay around here. I like how she hasn't said anything about this whole matter. Ah, there you are. Okay. And you're betrothed? Betrothed? <laughs> Do I look like the marrying kind to you? By the way, my name is Lyndon. I'm going ahead to the Drowned Temple. Our mission lies there. What the tomes say of Alaric and this temple is not encouraging. You must be Alaric the Guardian. Uncle Deckard told me of your eternal watch over this cursed place. I thought it was a myth. Are you Nephilim? No. There have been no Nephilim for a millennium. <laughs> Yet another myth. You seek entrance to this temple, but only a Nephilim can enter. If you retrieve the keys from the outlying tombs and use them on the gates, we will see who and what you truly are. Follow me. I will raise the bridge that you may pass. Seek two tombs in the woods beyond. The warriors rest and the crypt of the angels.
Are these Alaric's people? No, they are lost in madness. A test of my skill. Repel them, my brothers! I'll stop these things! Chaldeum. Why? It's such an open and beautiful city. It thrives on trade and new ideas. There was always something new and exciting to hear or see. Oh yeah, I... It feels like, oh well, they should only last for a certain amount of time. They should just die in combat. Yeah, like, they don't really die in combat. I can't know you do that you're okay. Like, the only thing that says that the only one that lasts until they die is our fetishes. But yet, until they die. Um, I don't think they ever die. But yeah, you got the big of honor. Keep up pretty well. It's quite the fact that we're running at like, I don't know how fast we're running. There we go. We're running. Yay, we're running. This is amazing. It reminds me of being a child and searching for lost artifacts with Uncle Decker. My strike is true. The guardians within. Although they are my brothers, they will seek your death when you enter. Look at this architecture. This predates the Sin War. None may enter the inner sanctum. Rise, my brothers. Rise and do that. Your strength rivals that of our greatest champions. What now do you think you are? You may enter our most sacred place. The noble hero fought his way here just to die. Magda! And who is this you bring with you? Adria's daughter? She has power within her. No matter. Your mother will soon share your faith with the one. The shard is mine. Fill this temple with their blood! What did she mean, my mother will share my fate? Could my mother be alive after all these years? 
Her words are lies and madness. Do not listen. This fight was too easy. She's toying with us. We must get back to Uncle Deckard right away. The world stone has been changed. Our children are born weak and suffer short lives. The demon Nereza promised to restore their power, but instead turned them into misshapen creatures and sent them to war against us. We may die, but not before she is sent back to the burning hells. When this is over, I could open my own little inn somewhere, if I live. That would fit you. Well, if you ever want a job, I will consider your credentials. You do me a great <laughs> honor. Yeah, there are credentials. You are... We're the creepy wood star with the credentials on, and has an army of... I was going to say, not dead things, per se, but an army of things. Or holding a chick. Yeah, go back. Let's just go get that guy who stands in the back holding a dead chick. Chick. Chicken. Fries. Chicken. Fries. Chicken. Fries. Fries. Chicken. Fries. It is strange that you waste your time in pursuit of women. Waste? Time is scarcely better spent. But you stay with none of them. I've only found one worth keeping, but she slipped away from me. I see. You bother women to ease the sting. Well, no. Sometimes they should bother me. <laughs> there you go. Anyway. The spirits say that you hang a mantle of shame on your shoulders. What crimes haunt you? I cannot tell you. You are a good man, the spirits say. Unburden your heart, my friend. You misunderstand me. We are literally unable to recall our pasts. The Inquisitors strip my sins and the memory of them from me, leaving me pure. There you, go. you spoke of your father before. I would like to hear of him. My father was a diplomat. We had a manor in Chaldeum with what servants, terraces, all of that. Everything changed when the trouble started. Somehow, rumors spread that my grandfather was responsible for the king's madness. My father's work fell apart. No one would speak to him. He kept believing it would blow over, though. Did it? No. I'd rather not talk about it now, if you don't mind. I've work to see to. Yes, you have work to see. Right. No, wait. No, wait. Yes, you... yes, you do. You do have work to do. <laughs> yeah, just that was all my okay, The world stone was an ancient artifact of immense power. It was used not only to create our world, but also to control mankind. The original humans were known as the Nephilim, and their power was such that it was feared they would tip the balance in the eternal conflict between the high heavens and the burning hells. So the world stone was tuned to lessen our powers, turning mankind into what we are today. But now that it has been destroyed, it is conceivable that the powers of the Nephilim will reappear. The best good, hey, protagonist. Tyriel was forced to destroy the World Stone when Baal, the Lord of Destruction, corrupted it in his attempt to control all of mankind. The spirits speak of the land splitting apart. It obliterated Mount Ariat, the mountain that housed it, leaving only a smoking crater in its place. And nothing has been heard from Tyriel since. Mm. 
I heard that you took Leah on your searches for ancient artifacts and tombs. Wasn't that dangerous? Not as dangerous as you might think. There was a calm about the world then. Most people paid no mind to an old man and young girl, weaponless and penniless, crossing their land. Yeah, so you just went to shit, well, weaponless. What? 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 Uncle Deckard and I traveled all over the world in my youth, looking for lost lore and artifacts. It was so exciting, crawling around ancient temples, digging through forgotten crypts. Without I feel weapons. fortunate that Uncle Deckard raised me the way he did, the things I learned from him. But now I... I don't know. I see what his obsession with his quest has cost him, has cost us. The Drowned Temple was once known as the Sarcium Emporis. It was the most sacred of their temples, a site where legend claims angels would come to impart their wisdom to the Nephilim. And of course it's right, conveniently you know, to Of course. Magda found us in the Drowned Temple. Even now, she seeks the third piece. I remember a glow streaking towards a fishing village. That must be Wortham. Ah, brilliant, dear Leah. Have the ferryman take you there. I'm going inside. Who is this coven to you? I cannot say, but there is something about them, a darkness, that is known to me. I sense this darkness as well. The coven may be part of a greater evil. Perhaps I intended to fight it. You will need your sword to do so. I will find it, my friend. How this would be as a crusade start. I've got some brand new goods you yeah, might be. Not, not, not really again. When it came to talk again. Oh god. When we retrieved the stranger's second sword piece, Magda found us. She's always on our heels. Who is she? She claims to know my mother, but how could that be? Regardless, we must beat her to Wortham in the final piece of the sword. Tell me of your glorious order. We seek the sacred tomes that were stolen by our like an What's in them? Not illustrations, perhaps? No. They contain prophecies of the end times. Without them, we are lost. But they have been gone for 20 years, and you survive. And we will survive a thousand more if we must. But the tomes will return to us. Must be spectacularly naughty then. Your heresy is intolerable. Well, there we go. So, I hope you all enjoyed. Thank you all, and have a nice day.